All right, we are back with night 20. It's our first playthrough. We have died th four times already. Yeah, we have one life left. Yeah, one life left. All right, I got a bunch of it other, you know, record that. I'll put that up later on um, if you guys really want to see that. But I figured, you know, might as well try this. Night 20, Alpha 20. Let's get this going. I got some good weapons here. Some not good. I built this big cage full of these new bars. Um, let's go ahead and just go. There's some pipe weapons. So they like to stand now, like, three tall at least. And I'm thinking they're going to at least find each other to get up over top of this first one. I got this another one that uh, hopefully is going to keep them from climbing into here. Uh, the last horde now did not go so good. <laughs> I got chased out of here and then uh, at the end of it died. So that was not good. Uh, because I didn't realize that they cannot stand on each other very easily. Look, he's standing on top of those dogs. Now he's standing on top of them. And now if somebody else jumps up there, I want to see how this actually goes. Can they stand through tall? Does it look like they can stand through tall? So that's an interesting dynamic because now they can just jump over these two tall ones. So if you're gonna build a, you know, this is just a standard bridge cage. Um, but if you build something like this, I've got these two layers here. Oh, they did. They got over top. They got over top. Okay, so they can go three tall. See, that's, that's new. That's a fun new dynamic, actually. And so you see here, I've double layered the bars. Alright. Um, on the outside, I have concrete. On the inside, I have the forged iron. Go ahead and get some of these going. Oops. Okay, get a little bit of that going. So this uh this shotgun here. This thing does some work. I just gotta make sure I don't hit those bars too much. I wonder if you can just put an extended mod on this. A magazine extended mod? I wonder what would happen with the other ones. Oh shit. Okay. So, what I found the pipe rifle, this, uh, this pipe SMG shoots the 762. This thing is probably the most useful of all of the pipe weapons. Pipe baton, not too bad. But, um, and I've actually, I've, I had a really good, uh, I sold it, but I had a really good pipe pistol. Uh, level 6 but still 6 rounds and it doesn't pack as big of a punch as a magnum it's not really worth 8 pounds to I don't think 
Like this one right here. You get a level 6 type SMG that I'll the stats of it really quick. So, not too bad. I got a uh, burst mod on it. I really get them all, you know. Get them all on one little uh, platform like this. And it makes things kind of easy. This is the way to do it though, because they can crawl. You can't just do one hatch. I have a hatch right here, and uh, well, I should say that that horde night did not go very well. <laughs> I ended up running around the entire horde night, just <laughs> trying to avoid zombies, take them out as much as I could. But I lasted in here until about. I don't know, about, about 12, maybe about 12 or, uh, I think it was even maybe about 1. It was, it was quite a while, but then all of them just started crawling. I think that middle bar is broken there. I think if that breaks up, the thing's going to fall, isn't it? Put a perimeter support right there. Put any support over on this side, I guess. Right there, possibly. This one's not too bad here. So this one's got, um, well, well, about eight less damage, less rounds coming out, but not too bad. Another one I found, and you cannot throw Molotovs through <laughs> these crates. I found out. <laughs> Oops. Oh, the other one. On to a 9mm. This is level 1, that's all I've found so far. Uh oh. Why is that holding stuff? How is that even supported? What is that support? Is that supported on that? What?
see. Let's see about the shotgun. Shouldn't be able to get into here. And if they break these two, essentially I can start using melee weapons. So that's not too bad. I guess that's a good backup to all this. The shotgun. I wish I could reload it faster. Because this thing is just. This is like a, a better blunderbuss. Like, <laughs> blunderbuss. This thing is satisfying. So it's just one shot. But See that just took out two people. Ooh. Now we haven't got any crawlers yet. There's spiders. We got to uh, we'll go back to the house after this, but essentially have a forge, have a workbench. Uh, I bought a motorbike uh, for thirty, no, twenty-seven thousand coin because I got a uh, ten percent discount on it for the better bar, better bartering perk. And then, uh, yeah, just been looting, killing zombies, uh, leveling up as much as we can. Look at all those loot bags. Nice. Perfect. Ooh, there's one. Ooh, they took down... They took down some of the ramps there. But I've still got essentially two more layers, so they should be able to jump up that so it doesn't fail on itself once... When the blocks is knocked out. Oh man, that guy. Alright. Let's switch over to a more accurate weapon. Alright. Is that everyone? Okay, so. I got that one for back up there. A little tiny area. They can still crawl through. But... If it's an overflow situation there, should be able to kind of take them out, hopefully, with a short burst. If not, you could run through here. This kind of stops them from going to side to side, so or from going just front. So will go side to side, and I can run around here, and they'll chase me, and then run out the other way, and run away. But these are held on the smallest of the stilts. Quarter inch uh, pipe I think is what the building block is. Underneath are the um, stairways. Let's see. Um. Okay, we got these ones, these catwalks. 
right so that's supporting that main floor up there and then the floor up there is made out of the bars which are down here you know everyone's familiar with those but now you can make those out of concrete so that's an interesting thing yeah upgrade them to steel um so eventually though <clears throat> eventually they'll have the same state um but yeah use those and then the the caging up there I used uh, these here so those there for some of them this for some of them uh, that for some of them yeah for the ramps going up and down I used let's see here Just a simple ramp. So if you just type in ramp, you'll find it right there. So that's just a simple ramp. Um, there's so many other ways though. You know, there's a lot of a lot of ways to build this. Some of them may be more efficient. Who knows? I just got a simple ramp going up. So we'll go ahead and replace these. And then we got bars up there, we got angled bars, so the corner bars. Okay, two layers of those, and then what you saw from the inside. So, pretty simple build. Let's go ahead and see what we got in these loot bags. All right. So what is what does this actually do? Saw that shot. We'll see what that does. We'll build one of those. Alright. Man, lots of ammo. This is excellent. So much ammo. And eat that. Get rid of that. Um, you know what we'll do? Drop this out. Oh yeah, look at these new motorbikes. These things are sweet. You can customize them. All the colors you want. Add mods to them. So, we'll get into that later on too. But, alright. Unload some of this stuff. So much ammo. Oh my gosh. This little I think this almost almost replaced how much ammo we spent. Oops. Let's go ahead and we'll look in the inventory. 141, 122. Ah uh, no, it's less than what we spent, but that's still that's a lot of ammo. That's way more than you got before. That's nice. I guess we're going to need it. Wouldn't be no reason why they gave it to us. Alright, let's go ahead and... Uh, oh, actually, you know what? We don't have any cobblestone. Alright. We'll fix that up later on. Let's go back to the place. Okay. 
throw let's see. Actually throw our ammo back in here. So we just need one stack. Put this food in here. These we're gonna sell since we already know them. And let's work on our hot bar. Alright, we're gonna throw that pipe shotgun back in there. We're gonna throw that machine gun back in there. Throw those back. These we'll throw back up here. This, let's go ahead and repair that. Brass trophies. Let's see. This. Same as what we got. Okay, so we'll just go ahead and sell that. Drop off this ammo here. Building parts. Pipes. Keep that with us. Throw the brass into here. that so we don't forget about it just throw it right there um, this will go into our cell container this will go into our food container and then we get a club back down there our sledgehammer back down there fire axe stick our shovel right here oops Put away to your iron pickaxe and our wrench. Okay, we'll sell that and we'll store that. All right, back ready to go. So, oops, put that away. <laughs> we got some things in the bike, but we don't worry about that right now. All right, so we got our workbench set up. A little cupboard up here with all of our ingredients to make our chem bench. We haven't found another bottle of acid. So, day 21, and we've only found four bottles of acid, and I am searching like crazy. I am looking everywhere. And I haven't found it. So, that's one thing. I think the drop rate of acid has gone way down. So it's a lot harder to, uh, to kind of move up. Also, another thing, the drop rate of weapons that you would normally find, way, way, way down. Um, I haven't seen, besides pistols, I haven't seen any other uh, more sophisticated weapon than the pipe weapons. Um, now I think I've found some blueprints. Yes. So I can make one. A level one AK. Hmm. We might do that. I don't have any machine gun parts, you know what? I'm gonna see if we can buy some. Because we got everything else to make that. And I imagine a, a level 1 AK would be better than a level 6 pipe machine gun, but I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe it won't be so good. Maybe. Maybe we should put some points. I got four points here. So maybe we should put some points into Anything you like? Machine Gunner. Oof. And see if we can Maybe Ooh. All right. well there's one machine gun post. Four hundred and fifty. 
Or 405. Isn't that 450? 405. Well, guess we'll buy it. Your leg armor. Yeah, so I built the forge and the workbench. I didn't buy those. Um, just uh, put some points into the engineering. Uh, points. All right, so let's see what he's got back here. Lucky looter. Find more brass. Hunting rifle. Magazine size one. No. Um. Power attacks increased chance of knocking down your enemy. That's a pretty good one. You know what? We're gonna buy this. Now we're gonna buy this. And this. I would wonder I would wonder how important that it's actually is like, you know, pleasure. I don't know you if we're ever gonna find there. military armor like we used to you know just out in the wild you just find military armor I imagine at a later game stage we probably will but okay go ahead and read these Was one other trader. Let's see if I can see where it is on the map. Yeah, look at this huge city. These cities are gigantic now. Oh. Okay. Well, south we go. spikes the worst. Do you ever feel like that when you're like golfing or you know, frisbee golfing or really anything that has trees as an obstruction? Oh, hopefully besides skiing, but uh, I feel like every single time there is a tree in front of me I hit it. Hit a golf ball right into a tree that was literally six feet from me. How terrible do you have to be at golf to do that? I, I'm, I'm, yeah. Alright, we're going to check in here. See if they have anything different. Mm -hmm. Are you a customer? Oh, a bottle of acid. And four machine gun parts. Was well, there need? something else? We needed four. Yes, sir. Let me see your inventory. Um. All right. Got enough to build an AK. We just need to make some uh, 
some ammo for it. Yeah, nothing really useful here. Lever action rifle. Huh. That's a different one besides the hunter's rifle. Gosh. Uh, I'm almost kind of curious enough to buy that one, but I would have to sell something. Well, good luck with that. with that. Okay. Check these. And the music sometimes in this. <laughs> the music definitely gets you uh gets you a little bit more on your toes. Okay, so we got we got acid, we got machine gun. Let's see about putting oh, something into this perk here. Uh, here we go. We already got five in it. Okay, crafting too. Okay, so you can unlock it just by putting craft, or just by putting skills into this. So we got, uh, let's see, three. Craft quality three already. How much can we get up to? We do four, five, what's this? all of those. Okay, pain tolerance. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. We want to make ourselves a little more durable. These zombies hit hard. There's, a, there's some rough zombies. Oh yeah, this is a uh, <laughs> this is one of those new missions where you can only do it at night. Hello. Oh, it's 
What's here? It's not... Wait. Where is it at? Is this... Is it this whole complex? I think all these are connected. So... One of the new things about this is like this um, restore power mission. You can only do it at night. If you go to the quests here, restore power. Huh. Wait, what happens if I start it right there? Okay, I can't start it. Okay, quest can only be started between 1200 and 1 a.m. So, alright. There are these, though, and these, these are nice. Yeah, these sometimes contain nice different books. So, those are really useful. Go ahead and just pop our head in here. Got some safe deposit boxes. Okay, nothing really in that. What's that? Nothing. Hmm. Oh god! Oh my god! Oh no! Oh no! Get out of here! Well, the cop blew up. I didn't kill the big boy. There's a little bit more room in here, isn't there? Man. That cop does some work. Okay. Looks like we've attracted quite a few people. Don't know if there's anybody else in here. Kind of sounds like there is. Might be right out back. Accurate, I guess. That's accurate, but geez, that's that's kind of hilarious. So th there's nothing in there, huh? Where is that zombie? I don't know where that zombie's at. On the other side of here. No. All right. Big boy didn't even do that much damage to this thing. We're thirsty. Gonna read that book. Oh, 
Wow, brought those blocks down quite a bit. So if you have a cop coming in your base, he's going to put a hurt on it. Forgot to bring my lock picks with me, but uh, I'm not gonna go all the way back home. Come on, let's go. It's probably gonna be nothing. A uh, pipe rifle. Pipe rifles are pretty terrible right now. They don't do very much at all. How did I get in here? This? Where is the other zombie at? There's some trailers back there. An appliance store right there. Huh. Let's go see what this is. Anybody need an RV? Drop rate now for acid and sinks seems to be super low. Okay, we got two more that we can dig through. Go ahead and just get rid of all the stuff we don't need. We already got a cooking grill at home. We don't need these nails. Eat that food. Scrap that, scrap that. Get rid of that. Alright, we good. Chop that up. Chop that up. Jump into here and there's the zombie. Hopefully there's not another one. Clear. Last one. That's a big bathroom. Oh gosh, there's two of them living in there. <laughs> uh, a cop and a tweaker. Okay, let's just go. Oh, what's this? A blue loot bag. The blue loot is this like better loot? I've never seen a blue loot bag. Huh. I mean it seemed like it was better loot. Looks like this one's also gone upstairs. Use that. Scrap that. Is this better than this? No. Uh, we'll repair that and sell that. Use this. Use this. Scrap. Scrap. Drop. All right. Let's check upstairs.
Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, so apparently that... That drops down into the main building there. Interesting. These new POIs are, uh... Are set up rather strangely, but... It does make you... Does make you think a little bit more about it, about how to tackle it and how to get into the actual place. Without, you know, spending forever beating through a door or something. We got a water tower up here. Let's just check this really quick. Okay. Yeah, we'll come back to it. Okay, well, since that's not open right now, and yeah, we got what we need, let's just go back and craft what we got. We can make a a level 4 AK, that's pretty good. So we'll uh, see what that damage is compared to the pipe rifle that we got. Probably just replace it. I think there's also another like speed mod or something. I don't know, there's a ton of new modifiers you can put on your vehicles. One of them I know is like a fuel mod, like a fuel capacity or something. I think another one's like a fuel saver mod. And then, and then there's these drones too that I guess you can get. They'll follow you around. Um, I don't know anything about those. But we will look into that for sure. Right, let's just go ahead and store these things. And toss this stuff into here. Let's see what else. Throw that in here. Throw that in here. that chemistry station 12 minutes oh. and then what do we need for this AK wait Did I read that wrong the entire time? Did I always say 4 out of 10? Or because we upgraded the, the level? Now it's more machine gun parts? Did I? Uh, okay. Well, we're going to save these machine gun parts. Throw these other materials into there. Just got a chem bench now. We can make some, uh, some more gunpowder. We've got. Let's see. Yeah. Got some coal. 
some nitrate though. About 300 gunpowder. Man, I can't believe that. Well, we could have bought that other machine gun part, I guess. Had we known that, but... Oh well. We'll find more. Alright. Well, this has been another amazing episode. Night 20, Horde Night, Alpha 20, Seven Days to Die. Doing a lot better than getting chased down by hogs this time. Catch you next time.